What is going on everybody, it's Drew coming to you with another comic book review, yes, I'm back with more comic book reviews, and uh, yeah, so, and uh, before I get started, yes, I want to let you know I do trailer reactions, film reactions, uh, commentary, podcast, and link up, want to link up with anybody, and collaborate, and all that good stuff, any recommendations, let me know down below, if you're new, subscribe, follow, all that good stuff. But before I get started, I just want to let you know I have not posted in a while, and there's a reason behind that, is because I live a real life. Obviously, I, I may have a couple channels on here, but I don't do this for a living. This is a hobby, and during the holidays, I was working tons of hours. I was gone from the house 12 to 13 hours out the day, so I was overwhelmed and just couldn't put together myself to post any content. But we're back. We're back. And I, and I also wasn't feeling well. So I'm, I'm kind of there back too. So anyways, I've been reading uh, Concrete Comic Comics. And I have a few videos from the past where I've read a couple comic books. One called Acolyte and Observer. Uh, Observer. Let me make sure I'm saying that right. So I'm going to start off with the review of this, this one right here. I got to say. I gotta say, um, and this is written by uh, Jamel Lessie. I, I gotta say, this is some crazy, some crazies. This is some crazies right here. And uh, this, this guy, like I said, this guy reminds me of like a Spawn. Um, I, I don't I, even. He's wor He's worse than Spawn, man. This guy is. But he's cool as, you know, he's cool. Then there's, uh, what's it, what's it, what's his name, Leah? Leah, he has, like, a partner that's with him. And I, I'll say this, man. This guy, he's pretty much the guy that, like, if they brought, it's like he came back from hell or some shit. Like, he's like the guy that, that like, let's say there's somebody in my neighborhood, um, Doing stuff to people, bad stuff, like killing their dogs, um, stealing your stuff, taking your important stuff, flattening your tires, raping your girl, or even at the church, molested boys, all that terrible stuff that goes on. This guy right here, oh, he'll set that straight. He'll set that straight. There's some images in this book where he went to a, just to give you some spoilers you ain't reading, he went to a church and took care of some, some like a priest, man. I say he took care of this guy, man. Uh, I mean, even in the, like, I think it was, the, I want to say the first one, he took, it was something about dude killed a cat. You know what I'm saying? So, he, he, you got, you got, you got investigators like, uh, detectives and stuff trying to figure out like what the hell we got to figure out who's doing this so they, they end up interrogating one woman which is she said she was a rape victim and she got pissed off because they're interrogating her because she admitted that if she found the guy who had did this to him to her she would she would take him out herself but she's like he's doing he's doing the dirty work for me good because that's who he is that's who he is. And he don't just get rid of He do it the worst possible way. I'm talking about kill you, hang you on the wall with your head hanging off. Got you looking like he's sending the message. Keep doing, keep doing what y'all doing out here. And I'm going to show you who you can become as well. That's Observer is the craziest this is this is it's this is so brutal that if this was to blow up and become a, a, a live action film, they would have you would have to be very careful with who you have watched the damn movie. I mean, I like it though. I like that craziness. Me personally, I like that craziness. Cause I, I read another uh, what was that other comic it was. Um, uh, 
I think it was called American Jesus. That has some crazy shit in it. This right here, this is even more, this is, makes that look like kindergarten. I mean, the, the, well, as far as the crazy level. And I like this guy. But he's now also, but issue four, he's now, he had to, he had to speak to his, his higher power. I think he had to calm it down, I think. I think that's where to go with it. I think he's trying to, he's basically, I think he's trying to tell him, like, you need to calm that down. That's not what this was for. Because he, 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 he crazy. So there's like another side story in this as well, where they, I think they call the Mesas and they're fighting these angels. And there's a lot of brutal uh, wars going on between these two different groups. And um, it goes into a little side stories of some of that going on as well. So it's, it's if you're going to read something like this, just make sure you're a certain type of person. You got a lot of tolerance because me, I got a lot of tolerance. I enjoyed it. And this is still going to be up there in uh, as a great series because it, it doesn't back away and it doesn't fear uh, of let of, of giving you something to look at and think about the dialogue was great the the backstories and stuff like that so this is definitely up there about to me after being finished with it this is a nine now th what does that say about me as a person I don't know you can make that judge yourself Based off what I said, you can look at me and say, you know what, you, this dude crazy as hell. He'll give one book this and give one book this because it's crazy. <laughs> it's just, it's crazy like that. Sometimes I think it's more important for creators to just put in what you think. What's on your, what's on your creative thought process? As long as you don't turn that to reality. But, you know, so... I like it. I like it. So I'd recommend it. Observer. Check it out.